Okay, seriously, I have been trying to film this video for the last half hour and my damn iPhone keeps running out of space. So I have to make this super quick. I think I have like six minutes and you know me, I talk way too much. Okay, so hi everyone. It's been a super long time since I've done a video and in my last video I said, oh, I'm back. I'm going to do videos. Okay, let's just say two things, summer and kids. So that says it all. I haven't been able to get back on track the way I wanted to. Excuse the all natural with all the gray showing. Um, I know I need to color my hair. I hate coloring my hair and I hate paying to have it colored just to color gray. I'm not cheap. I just hate the fact that I can color it, cover the color. I can cover the gray by coloring it myself at home, but I hate doing it. So it's, I don't know. I would be better off just paying someone to do it. But um, yeah, all natural, letting my pixie grow out. And um, yeah, this is my look of the day. This is my outfit of the day. <laughs> All right, I'm doing this video because I was challenged, not challenged, I was tagged by Monica. Monica on here, Monica, Monica here on YouTube is BC Doula, and she tagged me in a video that I was so behind on my videos and I had mit, so behind on watching my videos that I'm subscribed to. I didn't know I'd been tagged. So you were to list the three things that you would want with you if you're stranded on an island. And in her video, she mentions uh, food and water because she watches the show called Naked and Afraid. And no joke, they are naked and afraid. <laughs> I'd never seen the show. I'd just seen like when I flip through, you know, like the TV guide, I do this because you know that it means a remote. Um, and I'm like, what the heck? They're naked. Like, OMGZ, two strangers, girl and a boy. So anyhow, so my three things, and you know they have a show called Naked Dating? Okay, what's that all about? I haven't seen it. My husband told me about it, and then I was like, why are you watching Naked Dating? I guess you've put the word naked for any boy, man. They can't, they can't resist, like, what is that about? Sorry, honey, for throwing you under the bus. Anywho, um, so the three things I would want are definitely food and water, and I'm going to count those out as one because then it only leaves me... If I count them as two, it only leaves me one thing to be stranded with. So food and water, number one, food and water, number one, uh, books, tons of books and journals is number three books. Number two journals, number three. And then I think I could be happy forever. I'd probably get lonely, but if I had to just think right off the top of my head, it would be books and journals. Speaking of books, excuse me, I'm about to start my fifth summer reading book. I know I missed my goal. Um, I had set myself, I used to be an avid reader, uh, avid reader. I mean, I would devour books and then I had the twins. Um, and I've never been the same. I swear they're nine and I'm just still like in recovery. They kicked my butt, but, um, they read, have to read for school. And so I thought, well, it's a great example to see mom reading. So for this summer, I said, I am going to read, challenge myself. I'm going to read six books. I completed four, just finished my fourth one. Thank you, Yvonne. Um, I really liked it. Didn't like the ending as much um, of Gone Girl. I was like all into the book and then it was like, huh? Is there more? But anyhow, um, but I did enjoy it. I definitely did enjoy it. Um, so... Um, I borrowed that from a friend, from a, from a YouTube friend, which I'm going to be returning to you. So um, my next book I'm going to start is The Friday Night Knitting Club. I know it's an older book. I got it at my local discount, Friends of the Library bookstore. I can't wait to start reading this one. So I've just been reading and I've been journaling and taking care of kids for the summer. Now they're all back and hopefully I can get, you know, my groove back on and get on track. And I've been sewing because it's been too hot to work in the garage, which is where my crafty stuff is. I've said this before, it's attached to our house. It's a nice garage. It's it's not extremely hot, but sometimes it's just a little too warm to work in. And so I started sewing more because my sewing stuff is inside the air conditioned house. Come on, how, air conditioned, hot garage. Um, so anyway, hands down, I've been sewing, but I wanna share with you some of the things I've been making and doing. And um, that's my, my next few videos. I plan on doing with you guys, but I just wanted to do that challenge, not challenge, do that tag and say thank you to Monica for thinking of me. And um, I look forward to sharing more with you um, because I have a lot to share. I just need to get off my butt and get busy with my videos. 
Thank you for those that have reached out to me like, where are you? We miss you. I appreciate it. If you follow me on Facebook, I post on there a lot and um, you'll see a lot of things I make and I put funny stories or, you know, whatever, just kind of, that's my little, that's my little uh, um, fill in for YouTube. But anyhow, um, I really hope I get back to it. I'm not going to say, hey, I'm back. I'm going to do it again because then watch, I'll fall flat on my face again. But anyhow, thanks for listening to me ramble. Um, it was great to do a quick little video and come back because I hope to be back doing more. So anyhow, have a happy Friday. Have a great weekend and peace to you all. Bye.